Alright, so I'm back and I decided to just get to just start from where um from this part so we don't have to deal with the battling years, at least for the show anyway. Uh looks like I'm gonna have to um compete in two matches, because now I'm competing in a lab match against some unknown person. And after that I have to compete again against Kurt Angle and Stone Cold in a triple threat match, so Go ahead and do this. Who this unknown person is? I have no idea who he is. I don't know if it's an unlockable character or something. I don't know, but um, we might be finding out in a bit. And uh, yesterday's video was actually really long. It was like 40 minutes or so. And um, so I might go ahead. And, I, I don't think the video is going to be that long. Um, today. Probably gonna be like 20 minutes or so. It depends where we're on how we do it. Guess who this unknown person is. Unknown P. Okay. I have no idea who he is. He must be like, just like a, um, a generic character in the story mode. I really don't know. He looks like one of the VOD villains from NXT. And uh, this is the ladder match too. I don't think I've ever played that match mode in um, in this game. Well, let's just go ahead and give it our best shot. Why I'm, why I'm competing in two matches, I really don't know. I really don't know. I don't know how I pick up a match, but okay, it's R1. Get out. Get out. Okay. Okay, that's the throw. Let's set up. Like okay, I'm not sure how you climb it. I don't even know how he climbed it right there. Like I don't have an uh, I have an instruction manual with um with this game. I bought it from this place called Play for Play Trade for like two dollars. Like I swear to God, two dollars. Uh, it was pretty pretty cheap, so um, and uh, it just came with like this um, this case, this um, case, you know, the case that um, PlayStation games was coming, but it didn't have a name. Really. Uh, it didn't even have the actual SmackDown 2 case. It was just like one of those generic blank cases that you get from a game store. So I would have no idea how to climb a ladder. Yeah. Okay, so yeah, you run up to the ladder, which is kind of weird. But who am I to question this game? Yeah. I don't think so. Yeah, I'm gonna try and do like the last ride on him. So he can stay down. Oh, what? How do you do that? Here we go. How do you get up? What? 
Ah. Let's try again. Ah, what? Hey, so knock down a ladder. You can't pay them a ladder match. How even how he even got up from the um last drive is anybody's guess. There's some type of technique behind this. Ah, oh, what? Okay, I was robbed. That was a screw job. Now it's time for my second match of the night, a triple threat match with Curry and Stone Cold. And as we all know, I'm not a huge fan of triple threat matches, so I really don't care if I win this or not. Let's go ahead, get this over with so we can move on to uh, the next part. Ah, all right. Ah, oh, I just ran into him too. I ran into that. I wish I could. I wish I could get a weapon, but I guess I can't. Yeah, the soundtrack on here is really good. I mean, it's not that PlayStation, you know, type stuff. It's, I mean, it is kind of generic for PlayStation, but um, it's still pretty cool. Brings back some memories. Okay, that was good. Oh, I thought I got him out of the rain, but... I mean, I'm just beating the curve a little too cold. Like, I'm not even focused on Stone Cold, so I sh pro probably should, because he keeps attacking me. But my character's focus is on her angle. Not too easy to press the control to focus on some point. So. Don't block me. I'll just go ahead and focus on Stone Cold now. I've always got my finisher too, so I might be able to finish one of them off. But I doubt it. Yeah, 
Got my finisher already. I don't know who I'm gonna do it on. Everybody get up from that now. Used to be everyone got knocked out by that move. Now everyone immediately gets up after I do it. Like what kind of sense does that make? So, had that one. What? That was a three. I'm just doing running on DDTs, just. If I can win this, it'll be a miracle. Stop moving on my way. Oh, what? He gets a knockout, but I don't. Come on. That's a straight up cheating. My finisher could knock out anybody in a second. Now they just immediately get up from it. They no sell it. That's just cruel. Okay, tonight I will be facing another triple threat match. What is this game's obsession with putting me in triple threat matches? That's just not right. I was last year's king of the ring. This year I'll be the king again. Now to do these bad on me. I'll go ahead and cut the video and I'll start it back up when it's my match. Alright, we're back and it's a yet another triple threat match. And it's going to be against Mankind and Billy Gunn this time. And um, I actually didn't know that you could KO people in triple threat matches. I didn't know that. So I think I'm going to try and focus on beating up the... Um, I at least one to suicide as much as possible, then when I get my finishing move, do it on them. And hopefully, they'll be KO'd. I doubt it, but who knows. I'm a madman. Yeah, I'm a madman.
here we go. Let's see if we can do this this time. Focused on main mankind. I'm not trying to focus on the really, uh, okay, never mind. Yeah, like sometimes short threat matches can easily become handicap matches. That's that's kind of why I don't like them. Because they can easily turn handicap matches at any given moment. Yeah, keep missing. Bill Gun's about to get it. Nobody attacks me and gets away with it. I need to get my finisher already. I'm, I'm sick of this. Oh, whoa, whoa, what the? Okay, almost my finisher. Hopefully, we can KO. Doubt it. What? Okay, here we go. Hopefully. Yes. Finally, I, I win a match. What? Did the game freeze up on me? That's just perfect. That is just perfect. Oh, I was about to say. I was about to say. If the game froze up on me when I won a match, that would have sucked big time. <laughs> okay, now in the third week of June, we're almost to King of the Ring. And tonight, I'll be facing Stone Cold, finally, in an actual match. So I'll go ahead and cut the video here, and I'll come back. Alright, so, take her for the Stone Cold. This should be not that long of a match, honestly. Should be a little bit short, since I can dominate opponents easily. I haven't had a one-on-one -on -one match in this game in quite a while, so... Ah, yeah, that's what I thought. You don't count the dead man.
Yeah. Come on, Stone Cold. Rattlesnake, come on. How did I miss that? Stone Cold. Yeah, hopefully this shouldn't be that long of a match. Almost got my finisher. Either it'll be a KO or I'll just spin. Okay, now he's dominating me. Yeah, that didn't work the way I wanted it to. But I have my finishing move, so. Hopefully, Stone Cold will get knocked out, or... By knockout, or just go ahead and him. And he gets knocked out, alright. So, you told you the match wouldn't be long. Just go ahead and watch this because it's the end of the show, so why not? Okay, so we're on SmackDown. Won't be that long until King of the Rain. So tonight I'm facing Triple H in a singles match. Alright, so you know the drill. I'll go ahead and check back with you. Alright, so we're going to be Undertaker for this Triple H and. Much like um, me and Stone Cold on Raw, this shouldn't take very long. It should take maybe two minutes. Two minutes, probably. Yeah, I'm trying not to make this video as long as um, as the last one. I don't. I don't ever want a video to be like 40 minutes. Minutes. And like it, it does take like a long time to pass this game. It really does. But um. Uh, I might just put like, each video, I think I'm going to try and make one month at a time. Like this video is going to be June, the next video is going to be all of July, you know, so on and so forth. What was I even doing there? Okay, now he's dominating me. That's not the way it should go. Now it's starting to get back in, into the groove of things. Maybe not. Okay, 
almost got our finishing move. Shouldn't be too long until... Okay, let's just do it now. There's two late, Stephanie. <laughs> I love how as Stephanie Wright is about to interfere, I end up winning. That's just great. That's legendary. Okay, now it is King of the Rainy Tide. In the next event, eight of today's top young stars will do battle to determine who will be the King of the Ring. Yeah, King of the Ring tournament. I, I wish that was still around. I really do wish that was still around. You know. I think the last time that happened in WWE was when um, Sheamus won it. Yeah, that was like back in, what, 2010? Of, of course, I'm not even in it. What's up with that? Well, I'm still going to be in the main event anyway. I'm going to be facing The Rock, but still, why am I not in the King of the Ring? That's a travesty right there. But you know the drill. I'll go ahead, cut the video right here, and I'll come back and face The Rock, and we'll be done with June. Alright, so I actually ended up getting attacked in a cutscene earlier on, so I don't think I'm in the uh, main event anymore. I think that's what this cutscene is going to do. Possibly not. Uh, Snow Jowls. But yeah, they showed a cutscene earlier on in which it showed my character getting attacked backstage. Uh, it, it wasn't it didn't really specify who attacked me. You know, it was shown off screen. Uh, I was supposed to face the rock, but someone ended up attacking me and Billy Gunn and ended up facing him instead. All types of screw jobs are happening now. <laughs> okay, another cutscene. See what happens this time. You may have won tonight, but this is not over. Tonight was an accident. You just got lucky, that's all. Okay, so now we're in July. And so that'll happen in the next video. And I'll see you then.